Hello everyone, this is a good captain. Welcome to another video in my LP of campaign series West Front. This is the fifth mission in the Link campaign game Operation Sea Lion titled To Assault or Not to Assault Part 3. And yeah, we're just gonna jump right into it by first moving some trucks. <laughs> To surround an enemy. So, I know that this has exasperated some of you, but in any game I play, I am not above making gamey. Uh, moves and this uh, appears to be quite gamey, but again, I don't care. <laughs> I, if it kills the enemy, I'm I'm gonna do it. This helps kill the enemy. So uh, the next thing I'm gonna do is take this fatigued rifle platoon that's adjacent and assault this guy. And you don't need to disrupt mortars, in my experience. You do need to surround them but you don't need to disrupt them before you assault, they usually just die, so. Come on. Very nice. And the other simple thing is someone needs to overrun these guns that are in here. And it can't be anybody but you, so. Yeah, those are two pounders yeah, whatever they're dead now these guys you don't have to surround uh, anti-tank guns anti -inf, uh, inf guns or anti-aircraft guns usually just go down when you assault them yeah okay so that's good all right so those are out of the way And the last thing I definitely wanted to do was move this MG closer and shoot this guy. Wow, nice. Okay, and then hit this guy. Okay, and then everyone else, the rest of the mission down here is to stage for an attack against this position next turn. And crucially, part of this staging has to do with getting at least this one Stug in position to shell this 3-inch anti-aircraft gun. So, let's keep an eye on what he can see. Four, jeez. Yeah, we're gonna move here. That's fine. Can't hurt us. A one, well, it can, but it's at a one firepower. Um, I think I still have it pulled up here. No, no, this. Yeah, <clears throat> three inch A triple A. That was a range of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So he hits at an 8 soft targets, but look at this hard. As long as you won't get in at range 3 or less, which even then is not beautiful for him, um, we'll be fine. So yeah, let's move closer. One hex closer. Shell this guy. Okay, and hmm. 
five. Yeah, because we're disrupted. Not great. Where's our headquarters? Here you are. Yeah, we're not in a bad spot. Okay, let's go ahead and sh shell the trucks. All right. <laughs> Let's try for the infantry. Yeah. Okay. Hopefully he rallies. So you've moved, you've moved. So yeah, um, we don't want to move closer than range 3. X range three. Yeah, so you'll go. Well, yeah, let's go here and see what's in this village. Hmm. Should we go one more space? Not sure. Yeah. Yeah, we'll do something like that. Let me check this AAA one more time. Ooh, no. Why not? Because no matter what this thing shoots at, when it sees at range 10 or less, which is the maximum vision this scenario is allowed, 10 hex range, it will hurt anyone that it can see until it's disrupted at least. Huh. Yeah, so we'll just have to choke up on it from the front here. Let's move two spaces. And shoot. Okay. One, two, three. Yep, you'll move up here. Okay, that's everyone. Yeah, you're here and shoot. No effect. <laughs> okay, let's check the range on this guy. Yeah. Okay. He's disrupted. One, two, three. Can we move there and still shoot? No, we can't. Boy, I'm feeling... Well, we'll do one more turn of... Yeah, we'll just push forward one more turn, and then maybe we'll send some trucks in to pick everyone up, but we'll see how it goes. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Here. Yeah, and here. Just double checking everything here. Okay. Okay, we look good down here now. Up here. I hate to do this, but we're probably going to end up having to use these guys to do some scouting. Four VPs per strength point. Yeah, these things are pretty good. Panzer 4 Ds. Um, and I decided I was going to cut across the 
going to take this unit and sort of cut through the woods here. But we're going to have to clear this road for the trucks. Trucks can't cut through here efficiently, so. Yeah. I am sort of operating a, to do this move quickly. I'm going to be assuming there's not going to be anybody in these woods, so if I take any losses from this, I'll take losses from this. But it doesn't seem to be on like obvious path of resistance or a path of route, route path, so I'll be a little bit liberal in this maneuver. Okay, um, yeah, so the best thing we can do is, again, comprehend fully what we're about to send our guys into. Now, I'm worried more about mines than anything else. So I think the healthiest thing to do might be to just send this guy off the road. Huh. Okay, let's get some eyes into this little village here. Let's move you here. God, I'm worried about mines. Anyway, let's see that. I did this so that I could, you know, scan all these hexes for mines, and now we have a nice carpet of vision. I think we've really covered. Yeah, we did a pretty good job there. Okay, so we should. We're going to take a, a nice long look here at this section of the road. Okay, let's pick a unit to pair with. Probably the first turn where yeah I I need to get as close as I can to that thing and unload. So you'll go here and unload. Yeah, and you are. Jeez. We don't know where the enemy artillery is going to land now that it hasn't had, uh, hasn't been able to put eyes on anything over here for a turn, so a little hesitant still to move anybody. Really need to clear these mines, but then we will get going, yes, I promise. Hmm. trucks.
Yeah, 75 millimeter mountain guns. Well, there's one target. Let's go ahead and unload here. Shoot. Yeah, let's unload the other one. Right here. Try to get this guy if he continues to run. Okay, I think that's pretty much it. Ah, uh, yeah, where do we... Is this where we want our umbrella? And now I definitely know that the blue line is... The relevant range for aircraft coming in. Thank you very much, Mr. Patho. And hmm. okay, I want to extend the umbrella up to here. I don't think anybody can see these guys. Yeah, so we'll just stay where we are in case the RAF decides to show up. Which I have a feeling they'll do in the next turn or two, if they have any. Well, I should say I wouldn't be surprised. Bring this truck up. You never know when a good, you know, <laughs> but it, you never know when a good set of trucks will come in handy. <laughs> Uh, all right. Okay, all units have been considered. And now we will... Uh, first, let's make sure someone can see this guy. Yeah. Oh, no. I made a mistake. I can't. Okay, well, the Stug's closer. Maybe he'll shoot at the Stug, but this guy's in danger. It's a 10 hex range. Shit. Oh my gosh. Okay, well. Alright. Eight. Ah, bloody hell. All we can do is hope that this guy shoots at my tank and not at my troops because the tank's closer. If he does shoot at the troops, we have to just hope we retreat or don't get hurt. Dang. That was dumb. Bring some fire down. We'll bring... No. No. We need to bring everything on this guy. He needs to get disrupted. Damn it. All right, give the enemy its turn. Okay. Looks like they changed targets. Wow. If they brought it, they hit their own, they would have hit their own guys. Yes! Come on, keep it. Oh, they only fired once? Okay, come on. Yes, very nice. So maybe I was worrying too much about this thing. As long as there's a hard target close enough, maybe we can draw his fire. Well, oh, 
And we're, oh, we're low on ammo. And you're still disrupted. Still, you're going to have to bug light for this. These guys, so yeah, we're going to move you here. Does that thing... I'm going to pull the unit handbook. Does that thing take all of its action points to fire? Is that why it only fired once? Little pause. Aha! Look at that. Fire cost action points. 100. There's a... 20 millimeter... Yeah, 40 millimeter. Another common one that we've seen in this campaign. It takes 33, so we know it shoots three times again. But you, I did not, I that was an oversight on my part. This thing can only shoot once. Okay, so this became much less of a threat now that it's been disrupted and I learned that information and can bait his shots with this armor unit. Yeah. Cool. Okay, so let's just go about our business here. Uh, well, we want to unjam this traffic jam, so let's just move you back into the woods for the time being. Low on ammo. Cycle platoon. Yeah, there must not be anybody in here else they would have shot at us, so you're not disrupted. Okay, so small risk, but let's move up. Yeah. And shoot. And shoot again. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna... Oh, the mortars. Yes, of course. Wow. Well, I, I can't... Hmm. Yes, close in. Oh! No! Oh no. Okay, move one. Shoot. Dang. Wow, finally. Jeez. Okay, move in. So he's five hexes away. Not too convinced of that. I, I hope he shoots that. I, I, I believe he will. It's basically true of machine guns, so... Yeah, and let's move here. We'll be taking a nice look-see into what lies ahead by moving into that hex. Okay. Uh, ha, ha, ha. Yeah, let's just... I don't think artillery's going to fall on us, and as long as this guy stays disrupted... We won't be in terrible shape. We got our trusty trucks in the rear here, so we're the men's morale is, is good. <laughs> Alright, uh Ah, look at that, mines. And a roadblock. 
Which means you need to get off your asses. I'm going to turn behind. I need to... This is a turn behind. We should be moving into the minefield hex. No, that didn't help it. Okay, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Yeah, next turn they'll get on, jump on, and then the next turn we can move. So, uh... Now this is starting to make me a little nervous, what might be in this area, but... Send you. Okay. Here. Double time. Okay. So as soon as these engineers clear these mines, they'll have to clear these mines. I don't think we're going to clear this roadblock. Just have to eat that. Yikes. Okay, let's head around. Actually... We don't have eyes on that hex or this hex. I don't think there's mines there. Yeah, I'll take the risk. Oh yeah, that's right. The AI can't uh, yeah, I'll send you this way. some math, but we might take our trucks. And cut across instead of clearing these. Not sure, but I'm thinking about it. Alright, little pause and we'll wrap up this turn. Okay, I'm back. Uh, yeah, so let's do a quick cycle through. <clears throat> Oh, hello, yes, we need to do this. Disrupted. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so, of course there's some risk in any move we make, but let's move here. Oh my god. Alright, whatever. Good for them. Yeah, that can happen. It's point blank shot. In the open. Goodbye. You know, these... Uh -huh. Somewhere back here, there is artillery. And I really want to find it and destroy it. We're going to start out after that. Okay. Okay. 
Yeah, let's get you up here. Parachute 40. Yeah, let's just go like mad. Uh, don't like moving like that, but again, I don't think they're in there. Yeah, you gotta catch up. Yeah, we'll move these at the top of turn 10. You know what? for the option. guys hmm. yeah Up here price if I'm wrong about these three inch guns, but I don't think I'm wrong. I don't think I'm wrong. Yeah, let's use you as a test dummy. Feeling this is going to be the way we do that. We'll get up to he here. Actually, we might be able to do it from right here, this position. We move one, two, three, and then get back onto the road. Yeah, I think that's what we're going to do. We don't have time to clear these obstacles, we'll just cut across avoid this section of the road. Yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah, that's probably what we're going to do. Okay, let's finish out. Eh, let's move up a little bit. Oh, uh, the headquarters. Yeah, I think we were deciding to move. I was going to move you up. Yeah, those guys are out of range. Nothing we can do about it. Yeah, let's move here. That's probably all we'll need for the moment. And move the trucks up a little bit. can stay put for this turn. Let's just do a quick cycle. fire. Yeah, we'll leave it alone this turn. Okay, all units have been considered, and now we bring down our fire support. One each here and here, and two on the AA gun. And then we give the, uh, do we want air raids? No. And then we'll give the enemy its turn. Shot at this stuff. And this guy rallied. Dang. There's the leader. Still running. Stuck, still disrupted. just going to take you off of firing duties until you're undisrupted. We don't want you to go low on ammo. Okay, time check. Oh, we're good. Okay, first let's start with the mortar. Hit the guy that's not disrupted. Again, with the machine guns. Wow, come on. This is getting old. Okay, move in. Hit him. Disrupted. Let's hit these guys. Dang. It's going to take a turn. I don't think we're going to wipe these guys out this turn. Yeah, I mean, how could we? We got to make this guy retreat, frankly.
Alright, let's use these guns and see what we can do. Let her rip. Wow! Yes! Yes. That is exactly what we needed. Motorcycle platoon, double time. Surround him. Yeah. Ooh, three hex range. Ah, we got lucky. Just need to get this, we need to get moving, so. Yeah. Bye. Can't move. The only thing we can really do is move adjacent with the Stugs. Yeah, you know what? I'll risk that. Yeah, there could be some two-pounders in there, but I'm going to risk that. Three hex range. Two hex at six, three hex at four. Probably should have checked that before moving. Anyway, I still really, really, really want to do it, so let's hit this guy. still almost completely ineffective at this range, so. Yeah, I think we're gonna hang out. Okay. One, two, three, let's get someone in the woods if we can. No, we're running out of options. Okay, what about you? Ooh, what's this? One, two, three, four. We see some trenches here, but these guys have been here. Nobody shot out of them? One, two, three, four. I almost I have an inclination there might be just some anti tank guns in there by themselves, maybe? Let's see if we can bait any shots out of this village. Oh, look at this, in a fortified mill. Huh. Three, four, five, six. Yeah, outside of machine gun range. This one would be inside machine gun range. Yeah, let's check this hex out. Oh, you can't... Uh we wouldn't know if there's a rifle platoon in there until we... Mm. Not cool. Yeah, it might be... Yeah, we're not gonna... Let's come back. Let's have you guys move here. Put eyes on the objective. Okay. You'll move here. Yeah, it'll get us some nice, nice views. Yeah, move you here for the time being. 
Okay, that's pretty much it for that. Yeah, I think we'll make a... I think we deserve to take Harriet Sham for that 50. That'd be a nice addition. 205, I should say. Probably get it up to 250 with the units that we would destroy and we'd be at draw status. Which is a good place to be... Ooh, this, at the end of this turn it's halfway done. Hmm. Yeah, I feel, again, a turn behind. Okay, and then we'll continue to do our work up here. Likely enemy. Oh, no. Nobody must... There must be nobody there. So we want to stay at five hexes. One, two, three, four, four. Yeah, unfortunately. I think we're only going to be moving one hex. Yep. Right, you're disrupted. Give you up. Move you here. see if this is hmm you know it might be with these both these obstructions it might be easier just to clear this cut across this road here dump into the woods And then reconnect with the road? I, I don't know. Well, in that case, we would just cut across right now. Hmm. Not sure what the best way to go about doing this is. Not sure at all. All right, let's do the easy stuff first. Uh, hmm. Not sure about these hexes. Damn. Well, that's a great spot for sc scanning out a... Yeah, let's take a little risk. Yeah. Okay. So from here we'll be able to scan the road for mines. Hmm. Yeah, we need to get up top. Ok, 
Again, we're just we're just taking a look. Just taking a look. Hmm. Yeah, just join your brothers here. Okay. Here. 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 Double time. Here. Okay. I don't think we'll have any surprises. Pause while I do some math and some thinking. Uh, I'll be right back. Uh, yo, I'm back. So yeah, what I've decided to do is I'm going to basically just cut out this entire chunk of the road network here and move along the ridge line here instead with everyone. Uh, starting now. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, there's not going to be any more pussyfooting around. We're going to get going. So that's the route the trucks and this HQ will take. are still worth quite a few points, you know, so empty trucks exiting, three VPs per strength point, so they're 18 total, I mean, this is, yeah, this is how we're going to do it. trucks uh, for use down here, but mostly uh, mostly we'll send them north and go around. Wow. Yeah, let's move you here. Yeah, let's 
send you down the road. <clears throat> this turn. Not sure. Let's let's head over to this HQ. And uh yeah, we'll move the anti-aircraft umbrella. Let's see 66. I'm gonna try to keep it under or over 66 remaining. shot off if the RAF shows up this turn. Ah, yes, you. Okay. Okay, yeah, I know. Um, I just don't want to lose any strength points from these are only three per, <laughs> same as my troops, and th th these are these stugs are much well more well suited to absorb their fire than this. And we're up elevation. I think they're going to stay put. We'll yeah, Let's see if we can't help our troops out. Yeah. Okay, let's call down some artillery. One. Two and one. Ooh. I really want to put one right on the objective hex, so I will. <laughs> and, hmm. <laughs> yeah, no air raids. We'll save those stukas. Give the enemy's turn. Okay, good. Phew. For the tanks. Good. Oh no, they're gonna shoot our guy. Oh, they shot the tanks again. Excellent. Yes, both stunts are up. And the motorcycle platoon. Well done. Well done. Okay. <laughs> Very cool. Very cool. What's the time? Yeah, let's do one more turn and then close this video. Wow, look at all the mines. And the mines back here as well. I think I'm gonna do start up here first. Yep, there's a there's some mines. So we need to get eyes on more sections of the road. Okay, let's remember this hex. <clears throat> Ringlestone, right at the elevation change. In case we lose it, Ringlestone. Okay. Let's 
Move the motorcycle platoon first. Yeah, this is all... Let's move the troops first and see what's left. Yeah, that won't work. So you'll just move normally. Ooh. Is that an engineer platoon? That's not a rifle platoon. Yep. Now oh, we gotta clear somebody, don't we? Hmm. I have them up on the No, I don't. Yeah, I do. Here they are. So engineers at range 3 hit on a 2. Yeah, they're pretty they're pretty crappy against soft target or yeah, against soft targets. Okay, so we're not terribly worried about these guys, but you know, we don't know where there might be two pounders. Here and here might be good for looking forward. Yeah, so let's move you here. Yeah, some risk in doing any moves really. moved yeah there could be mines frankly anywhere so where can we maneuver to shoot we don't want to get too close because those are engineers those will mess up our tanks if they decide to go for them let's just go here oh, there's no mines Take a look. Where are we? Oh, jeez, we are far away. We got to step on it. Yeah, 
safe. Okay. sure we're gonna make it. That is a huge distance to cover. Anyway, I just want the minor victory, frankly, and to take really no losses. So if we can if we can attempt the major we will, but I need to recoup some losses from Canterbury if at all possible, so, yeah, we'll see how it goes, but, shooting for the minor, okay, all right, where's our motorcycle platoon, excellent, excellent, wow, Let's move to a three hex range. Draw whatever fire. Ooh, look at that! A headquarters. Hmm. Yummy. Two, three, four, five. But now, unless we move our stug closer. suppose we could do, we cannot move into hex range 4 with this gun still active. <laughs> so yeah. You know, I'm thinking we should move to hex range 2 with that stug and then assault that anti aircraft gun and just get rid of it. But hex range 2. It's on a 3. It's not great. That's definitely not nothing. Where can you get? Where can we get? Two, two. Hmm. <clears throat> I think we're gonna take a risk and try to blast him next turn. Or overrun him next turn. Let's move here, here, Make sure we can move into that hex this turn. 
So we up and over a hedge for seven, open ground, open ground, and then 65. Open, open 26, 7, 28, 29, 30, 31 through 2, 33. Yeah, we should have one SP left over. But we want to bait this guy's shot first, don't we? Just to make sure. High risk operation. It's really not anything else that we have that we can do, really. The other one in behind it. You know, hmm, we could shell. These guys are stacked right on top of each other, and the artillery is definitely in our area. Let's risk it. Nice! Wow. Okay, well, let's get those guys loaded up. Get them moved out. Wow! Wow. Alright, so aim you guys like this. Good, and now we can seriously begin reducing this position. And maybe we can get around them and stop the trucks from escaping now. Yeah, let's move you here. Should we overstack? Leave you there. Hmm. Now nah, let's let's assist in. Yeah, let's assist. Okay, and then move the guns. Where do we want to move the guns? Towards this way. <laughs> Let's move up with those trucks. Oh yeah, the anti-aircraft guns. OK. 
Okay, everyone that looks like, yeah, we want to protect is protected. Let's leave a few, well, I could get closer. Yeah. Oops. Yeah. Yeah. You'll stay put. Okay. Okay, now we call down our art. Ooh, now we call down our artillery. And we will lose sight on some of these hexes, unfortunately. Hmm. Yeah. Okay, so let's bring down two here. Well, let's just bring it all down there. Yeah. And give the enemy its turn. Did we cycle through? Yeah. Yeah, that will give the enemy its turn. Shooting at the motorcycle with you. God, I don't want those guns. I don't want to suffer another British camera. I'm good. I'll slow him down. Are you serious? This it'll be 258, probably closer to 300 plus once we knock out all the units therein. Looks like a very comfortable minor victory, regardless of what happens. And really, I just need to make a decision on if we're going to really push for that major or not. But that is a decision to be made in the future. So thank you for watching this. All the best from the good captain, and bye-bye.